<laughs> oh, hi guys, I'm Socks. T today we're going to be reacting to this video called Killer Maid from Willow's Pet Shop. Aww. <laughs> I feel sorry for the kids. Yeah. So, uh, let's get started, shall we? Yeah. Let's get started, shall we? What the heck? Oh, what the heck? Huh? What the heck? Oh my. Oh, dear lord, what is this? What on earth, man? Huh? What's happening? Oh my! Blood! Oh dear! She's pretty. What's going on, Mom? Yeah, what's up? Ooh. Well, kids, as you may know, I had to work a few extra nights to support the family. Mm. Uh-huh. Go on. Mm. Yes. Ever since your father divorced me, I've had the trouble keeping up with work and keeping the house clean. And so, I have decided to hire a maid for us. Whoa! Oh, I bet it's a killer maid. It, it is awesome, yeah, but a killer maid's not awesome. She's going to be working here for five days a week while you're at school and I'm at work. But we're on spring break. True, yep. I know that, but I've already paid her for this whole week. Anyways, even when you two are on a break from school, she'll still be here five days a week to help us out with the cleaning. And since you two are on a break from school this week, I wouldn't mind if you helped her out with the cleaning, please. Oh, come on, Mom. What's the point of having a maid if you're just gonna make us do the cleaning anyway? Yeah. You two are 14. You shouldn't be arguing about this anymore. Now, the maid will be here any minute, okay? While I'm gone, please treat her nicely. She's a really good girl. Have you met her yet? She's not a yes. good girl. Her name is Meredith, and she's 25 years old. Now, I have to get going, and... Oh, that must be her right now. I hope the new maid will take orders from us. I know. I really need new laundry. I know. Me too. Okay, come on. <sighs> Hello there, Meredith. Hello, Ooh, Mrs. She's a, so Meredith's a cat. Like me. So great to see you too. Come on in. Wait a minute. Something suspicious is about her. Meredith, stop lying. Um, would you like to meet my kids? Oh, yes, your children. Did you say that one was a girl and one was a boy? Yes, I did. They're standing right over there. Oh, what the heck? They look like little angels. Yes, they are. Meredith, this is my son, Jackson, and that is my daughter, Alexis. Wait, what the? Alexis and Jackson, this is our new maid, Meredith. Can you do my laundry, Meredith? Um, I suppose. <laughs> <Check>. Wait. <laughs> Anyways, I have to get going, Meredith. Could you please do the dishes, wash the windows, and clean up their rooms, please? Absolutely. Anything I could do to help you out. She's you not going to do the dishes. She's lying to you. Love both of you. Be good, okay? Okay, Mom. Okay, Mom. They're always good. Bye. Uh, what game? All you have to do is go into the closet. Wait, I know what the game's going to be called. You're trapped. You both are trapped in the closet while I steal your prized possessions. I know that game. Because I'm a smart cat. Now, Meredith, don't do anything so rude. Uh-oh. 
Meredith, don't be so suspicious now. Yep. Uh, Meredith, uh oh. Is this part of the game we're playing? Why, yes, it is. It's called You Both Are Trapped in the Closet While I Steal Your Prize Possession. I knew it! She's mean! She's what a robber! She said we're trapped in the closet while she steals our prize possession. Oh, poor fellas. Do you know what that means? Mom hired a thief! Heck yeah, she did. Yeah, come on, they're not having fun. I'm very busy. Oh, Meredith. Meredith, seriously, this isn't funny anymore. Just let us out. Yeah, let him out. Be quiet or you will get it. That's rude, Meredith. What the heck is she saying? What the heck is she saying? Hold on. It's so dark in here. I'm going to find a flashlight. Jackson! Here, I found one. Heck yeah, she is. Oh yeah, she is. Meredith, what is your problem? Poor fellas. Heck yeah, it is. Meredith, let's out of here. Yeah, come on, Meredith, let him out. Uh -huh. And why would I do that? Meredith is getting way out of control. Meredith, yeah. Meredith, you can't do that. 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 Well, you deserve it. Yes, freedom. I was almost about to suffocate in that. <gasps> Mom, you're home. Yes, I am. Heck yeah. So, did you have a good time today? No, they didn't. We had a wonderful time, Mrs. Shrine. It was. No, you didn't. Right. Stop lying, Meredith. That is great news. <laughs> well, I best be on my way. It was wonderful to meet your kids, Mrs. Shrine. And it was also wonderful to work for you. Thank Stop you. lying, Meredith. You didn't work. Ta -ta. You stole the possessions. Ugh. And see you all tomorrow. <laughs> uh. Yep, there's a gun. No, they didn't. Yeah, yeah, it was very fun. <laughs> they didn't have a wonderful time. Okay, where's my computer? Well, uh, well, okay, okay, okay. What? We have to tell her. Tell her what? That man is a thief. Yeah, tell her. Yeah, she won't. Please keep it a secret. Yeah, Mom please keep it a secret. And what happens then? She's gonna shoot her heads off. But not with Mom in the room. <sighs> Come on. We're going to tell Mom. Mm-hmm. <sighs> okay, fine. We'll go tell Mom. Mom. Yeah, please tell Mom about Meredith. Please tell your Mom about Meredith. Yeah, please listen to them. Okay, then. I'm listening. Go on. 
Mom, Meredith is not who you think she is. I agree, Wait. yeah. Mom, Meredith is not a trustworthy person. Yeah, she's not. You have to fire her right now. Yeah, please. You can't just tell me what to do. And why uh, Miss Shrine, you're just confused. She's a sweet girl. No, she's no, not. She's not. Mom, she's a thief. She yeah. Yeah, I agree with the kids. Yeah, please. Yeah, she is. No, she ain't. You're just confused, Mrs. Shrine. Yeah. I don't think you're pulling a practical joke. I think you're being serious. Mm -hmm. That was pretty bad. Yeah, True, yep. We were in trouble big time. Uh-oh, let's get out of here. Yeah, get going. Oh, dear God, this is not good at all. Uh, day two? It's a good morning indeed, but... Oh my gosh, are you guys okay? <coughs> We're sick. They're just trying to make you believe yeah. them. We've been coughing and throwing up all night. <coughs> you were? Why didn't you guys wake me up and tell me? Uh, be because uh, we didn't want to disturb you. Yeah. Yeah. Our puke is pretty gross. Yeah, it was. <coughs> yeah, it was. Mm -hmm. Guys, it's pretty unhealthy. You should have woken me up and told me. I could have helped you. <coughs> yeah, and since we're sick, <coughs> Meredith can't come over. <laughs> yeah, because we're sick. <laughs> you want to get her sick, do you? <coughs> we don't. <coughs> yeah, you don't want to get her sick. <sighs> Alright, I'll call Meredith and tell her not to come over because you two are sick, and then I'll take care of you for the rest of the day. <sighs> Oh, heck yeah! Hi, Meredith. Yes, it's me. My kids are sick today. You probably can't come over today. Meow, meow, meow. Perfect. I'm better tomorrow. I'll see you then. Okay, goodbye. Alright, kids. Looks like Meredith's taking the day off today since you two are sick. And since you are, um, I'm able to work from home today. Come on, Mrs. Shrine. You have to believe your kids. Mom, aren't you able to work from home anytime? Well, not anytime. Only when you two are sick. Why? We don't want you to leave us. Yeah. Yeah, they don't want you to leave. True. Is this about Meredith? Uh. No, Mom, of course not. I agree, yeah. I love you so much. Why would you two think she's a criminal? She's not a criminal. Come on, Mrs. Shrine. You're just confused. She is a criminal. Mom, listen to us. Meredith is not who you think she is. True. She's a criminal. Yeah, she oh, is. Stop that? What you both are saying is nonsense here. It's not Meredith nonsense. You're just confused. And she would not do anything She's like not a sweet gal. Us or murder us or anything. Uh, you both are even sick at all. I can't believe you two lied to me and that you think Meredith is a criminal. I'm calling her. Come on, they're just being serious. <sighs> Mrs. Shrine, you're just confused. Right, <laughs> this is so unreal here. Yeah. Yeah. I cannot believe Mom won't believe a word we're saying. Yeah, but I believe she you. It nonsense. Yeah. I cannot believe her. Huh. I hope huh. Mom's happy when eventually Meredith kills us because we ratted her out. Oh. <sighs> All right, kids. I'm off to work. For real. <sighs> You're just confused, Mrs. Shrine. Hey, they're not doing much nonsense. It's not their fault.
Like, what the heck? It's not actually their fault. Oh no, not Meredith. I agree. They're not. Meredith, they're not lying to you. <gasps> Meredith, don't. Yeah, please don't. Yeah. Yeah, please. Oh my god. Now, do you have anything I could tie you with? What? 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 Meredith, this is getting ridiculous. Just please let us go. Mm -hmm. Sorry, can't talk now, super busy. Excuse us, but you do have time to talk. Let us go right now. I agree. No, they didn't. Oh, plenty of fun. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty sure no, they well, didn't. Um, gotta go. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Ow. Well, she acted a little strange today, don't you guys think? Yeah, I guess you could say that. <laughs> Mom, that wasn't acting. Meredith is a criminal! True, okay. yeah. How long are you two gonna keep this up? Mom, we're being serious! That was the reason Meredith tied us up! We weren't playing cops and robbers! She was actually robbing us! And she tied us up to keep us from stopping her! Mm -hmm. Can you stop moving? I'm about to fall off this chair here. Just believe us already! That's it, you two are grounded! What? Why? I wasn't doing anything! Alexis and Jackson shrine! This joke is not funny anymore. Meredith is a really sweet gal, and she wouldn't do anything like rob us or hurt us. Uh, no, that's not no. true. But, you know, it wouldn't be a bad idea to just keep you tied there until the morning. Hey, that's not fair. Uh-huh. 
kids must have done this. Ah, we're going to do with those guys. It's not their fault. Kids, I'm off to work. The breakfast. Uh. You guys okay? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Yeah. You sure? Because you look pretty tired. True, yeah. Yeah. It is. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm hmm. Okay, well, I'm off to work. Meredith will be here in a few minutes. I love you. Mm. Love you too. Yeah, I love you yeah. too. You know what's wrong? We had to show her the gun. Oh my god, I forgot. Oh my god, hold on. Oh no, 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 no. What? What's wrong? It's not in there anymore. What? Yeah, it's what not in there. What? what happened to it? Meredith I'm has it. <laughs> oh, I'm nuts. Yes. Huh? What? But what? I saw you were gonna rat me out. Well, you deserve oh. it because you're mean. You're gonna die. No. no. They don't deserve to die. I don't like this at all. Yeah, it's not. Because I saw you hide the gun. What? Last night. What? You were stalking us? Yeah, we're, you were? Meredith, please don't do this. Yeah, please don't. It's, too late. it's not too late. Uh. Goodbye. No. Now? Uh, freaking cell phones. Uh. Uh. Okay. I'll be right back. Stay there. Uh, thank heaven for cell phones. Yeah, right. I know, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> They're not they stupid. I'm the maid, but really, I'm the killer. Of course you are. They got all this priceless jewelry that's so easy to steal. My so-called boss has kids, and I always take them hostage, like lock them in the closet and tie them up. You shouldn't do that. All their priceless jewelry. Like seriously, the jewelry is like so fantastic, so fashion forward. <laughs> Yeah, my boss, her name is Samantha Shrine. Like, it's so easy to get past her. It's so easy to hide my identity from her. No, I mean, it shouldn't I'm not be. I'm really a maid. I'm just a murderer and a thief. <laughs> of course you are a murderer and a thief. Yeah, I always greet her every morning, but really, I, I, I really don't mean it. I don't really mean to greet her nicely every morning. You just, just like to, to hide your secrets you know? from her. This job is so easy, Jason. You don't even understand. Although I do know we used to rob banks together. <laughs> uh. Yes, my impersonating maid thing is still going on. I'm still impersonating the maid. I'm not really, I'm, I really not, you know. <laughs> you know what I mean. <sighs> yes, the impersonation is going well. Uh-huh. This job is so easy, Jason. I love it so much. You're just hiding your <laughs> secrets from... The boss paid me the mother. this week already. And so I can just get away with any, anything I want. She's at work most of the day. <laughs> Jason, I love my job. <laughs> Do you understand that? I love it. Okay, I gotta go. See you later. Bye. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe it. Yeah. Oh my god. She liked them all. Heck yeah, she did. She liked to all of us. Mm hmm. Yeah. She. <laughs> Likes to hide secrets from her. She's just impersonating one. Mm-hmm. She likes the whole family. 
Heck yeah, she did. I'm done with my stupid cough, my stupid ex boyfriend. Now, let's get down to business. No. <gasps> no. Yeah, no. Come again? No. Do not touch the gun. Yeah, don't. You don't not now, J Jason. Gun. In fact, I think you deserve to use it on you. Yeah. Excuse me? You lied to mom. You lied to all of us. Heck yeah. Not even a real maid. Yeah. We're just figuring that out? No, I knew it all along. Mm -hmm. My mom does not deserve to deal with such ruthless people like you. Yeah, I agree. Alexis? Not now, Jason. She's just standing I'm up for herself. Jason, not now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, true. Alexis? Jason, not now. She's standing for herself. Well, you deserve to be called egghead and all that. Yeah. Jason, not now. Yeah, take that. Jason, not now. Well, you deserve it. They don't deserve that. You do. Like, what's your problem, <laughs> Meredith? Yeah, please. Well, you deserve to be called names, Meredith. They're not the worst, Meredith. No! Poor, poor fellas! Meredith! You big jerk! And there's a lot of blood. Poor, poor Miss Shrine. I've seen someone cry like that before in horror. Heck yeah, they were. You're so mean, Meredith. You need to learn your lesson. Liar. Liar, it was you, Meredith. You're not sorry you did it. Heck yeah, I agree. It's not all your stuff. You were robbing them. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. The they're not they're stupid, not Meredith. Liars. They always lie. And they're not liars. They're You're a liar. Call my kids stupid. Yeah, how they dare you? You lied to me. Yeah. This is no time for Well, you deserve you it. Yeah, get out, Miss. Yeah, get out, Meredith.
police right now. What is the suspect's name? Meredith Fallon! Her name is Meredith Fallon! Please, help me hunt her down! Please! All right, ma'am, we're contacting the police right now. Please stay calm. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I've never seen someone cry like that before. And that's a lot of blood. That part always makes a heartbroken sense. Yeah. Breaking news. Oh. Just a few days ago, a horrible tragedy struck down in downtown Nebraska. 25-year-old Marriage Farland, one of the top 10 most wanted criminals on FBI Most Wanted, was so-called hired to do some house cleaning for Samantha Shrine's household while she was at work and while her children were at school. Even though Samantha Shrine's children were on spring break that week, mm -hmm. Meredith Farland was still paid to do the house cleaning that one week. But instead of doing the house cleaning that Meredith Farland was supposedly paid to do, she pulled out a gun, shot, and killed Miss Shrine's beloved children. Right now, we both have Samantha Shrine and Meredith Farland waiting to be interviewed. This is so they can both tell about their side of the story. Let's talk to Samantha Shrine first. Well, I hired Meredith on Monday, March 17th, so she could do the house cleaning while I was at work. But my kids, they were home alone with her most of the day. Like, they, they experienced what Meredith was doing to them, what Meredith was doing in my house. And they kept telling me, that Meredith was not a good person. That she I agree, was she's not a good person. But I didn't believe them. I didn't believe every single word that they said because I thought that they were just pulling a practical joke on me because but they weren't. that's what they used to do when they were They were being serious. And I, I just got so mad at them because I thought they were lying to me, but, but I they weren't. later on it was Meredith that was lying to me. And yeah, it was Meredith. I came home on Wednesday, and I I found I found my kids just lying on the floor dead. There was blood everywhere, and it turns out they they were telling the truth. They were telling the truth that Meredith was not a good person. She wasn't even a real maid, and she killed she killed both of them when I wasn't at home. And I just wish I would have believed them because they were telling me the truth. They were just trying to tell me that we hired the wrong, I hired, I hired the wrong person. I hired the wrong person to take care of the dishes and everything. And Meredith, she just didn't, she, she, we, we talked on the phone, we talked on the phone and, and, and she told me everything about herself, but she left out the part where she was a real killer because obviously she wouldn't tell me that, but it's just... She's it's be just it's so because she's irritating. hiding secrets from you. I just wish I would have believed my kids. I just, I just wish, I just wish none of this would have happened. I just wish Meredith told me, told me that she just wasn't... <laughs> I just cannot believe she'd do something like this. I just... Heartbreaking. I feel sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't believe I'm gonna. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I need to tell you. I'm sorry. So, the shrine claims that when she wasn't at home, Meredith With Jackson really bad things. And her kids tried to tell her that. But yeah, like, no, right now, now, Jackson. It's just Samantha. That when she wasn't at home, Meredith Fallen was also. It's just your daughter or well, sure your sister was just trying to stand up for herself. Yeah. Shrine what she was doing in her house. 
We now go to Meredith Farland's interview to see what she has to say about the tragedy. Okay, I know I did kill Miss Shrine's kids, but that was for a great purpose because, well... It was not a great purpose. And of course, I don't well, want you deserve that. to be wrapped out. Miss Shrine to figure out what I am doing in her house. Like, I don't want her to figure out that I was stealing all of her priceless jewelry. I mean, could she blame me for stealing all of her jewelry? Is she like, I think before she got divorced, she was like rich or something because like her jewelry is so fantastic. I think she like gets it from Tiffany and Co or something. And well, the other reason I killed her kids was because, well, her daughter, Alexis Shrine, she was like telling me off. She was like calling me names and then after that- Well, you deserve to be called names. And I got out my gun I started shooting everywhere, and I guess, uh, well, I shot the kids, and I'm like, well, that was, that was, well, yeah, I just, I just went mentally insane, and, yeah, I, I killed them, I killed them, I, that, that's what happened, okay, uh, don't judge me for what happened, okay, life happens, people, people die, you should know that people die, people die every day, and people are born every day, which means the population will just, will just keep going and going and going, and yeah, in my opinion, those kids deserve to die. No, they don't. They you deserve to die. To me out just like well, you deserve that. to they be wrapped out. going to die. They had it coming. They had it coming, and... They had it coming, they had it coming, yeah. Meredith Farland has now been sentenced to life in prison for this horrible tragedy. Mm hmm That was this week's breaking news. See you next time. Meanwhile, what the heck? So yes, her name is Meredith Farland, capable for theft and murder. <laughs> Oh. I'm really sorry, ma'am. You deserve to go out like this. I know. They must have been good kids. They are good kids. They were. They were wonderful kids. Mm hmm. It's okay, ma'am. Alright, we have to get back. Hang in there. <laughs> Goodbye. Aww. Okay, it's okay. Terrible father. Oh, 
Aww. So interesting. The end. Aww. Whoa. That was a great video. Yeah, it was. <laughs> and, uh, I agreed with the kids. Yeah. And I said, Mrs. Sean, you're just confused. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. That's the end of the video. I love you guys. Yeah. Mwah.